football side at the Rye Super Club. One Leicester Square, England. And we welcome the monster from Manchester. Mankenstein, Peter Henderson, is six feet tall and 86 kilograms. This man is the reigning British national champion. His opponent hails from Urk in the Netherlands, standing 6-1 and weighing 94 kilograms. Welcome the thing, Mered Nentjes. This man is the Dutch national champion. Before we get things underway, let's have a little look at some of the important rules of the sport. The athletes have one minute to get a fair grip. Their elbows must remain on the 7x7 seven seven elbow pad throughout the round. The referee can award a running foul during the match, which is a little bit like playing an advantage in soccer. And an athlete on a running foul must win the pin in order to get the restart. Two consecutive fouls by any athlete loses them the round. Here we go, Mankenstein. Peter Henderson has come ready to London. This man is supremely confident as the reigning middleweight champion of Great Britain. And he is a beast. Mankenstein, revved and ready. That calm demeanor. But inside, he is a raging torrent of aggression, believe me. And the man he faces is known for that intensity. It's the thing, Maynard Nentjes. No stranger to the Super Series, Nentjes, fresh off the Europeans. Here we go. Ready, go! <laughs> Big drive off the start. But ominously for Nentjes, he lost the hand and wrist there. Wrist there. And he will need to keep that. Carved under is Mankenstein. Oh, big drive. Keeps that back pressure applied. And Peter Henderson with the win. Look at that. Mankenstein allowed himself to be carved. He shorts up the pressure and then back pressure. A dragging hook down to the pad. The win for Mankenstein. Peter Henderson. Do not go inside with me. Do not. Yeah. Yeah. Straighten these Ready he is to there. explode into that hand and wrist. Big drive. Just <laughs> equal to it. Maynard <laughs> struggling to contain the hand and wrist, and that Straighten could be a pivotal factor here. There. Peter Henderson so Ready sharp go. on top, and he rolls across. Big drive. Then Jez, wrist is carved open, and Henderson goes to rest. In a great position there. And he'll let Nent just do all the work because he's exposed the Dutchman badly. Got that yeah. hand and wrist yeah. open and drives down. Yeah. Oh, he's on the running foul. That was never a foul. Oh, unbelievable. Club, he didn't he's didn't been called on the running time, foul right? and he's no, shouting over no to my commentary no point no as he way. hears me announce that. No way, I'm not having that. No but way. it's not my decision. And Peter Henderson no way. has been put on the running foul. Elbow been off the back of the pad. Oh, look at that on the replay, clearly. Yeah, the points go oh, clearly off the back of the pad with the elbow. Look at that, riding on the back of the pad and there again. There can be no complaints from Peter Henderson there. He'll hate me for oh, saying that, that but the there. fact still is the there. fact. Yeah, and he'll out. need to do it again. Ready go. In his favour is the fact that he doesn't look like losing hand control anytime soon, and Nentjes has it all to do. Containing the man from Manchester. And Peter Henderson goes to two. Big drive across. He secured hand control. And he may have done some serious damage to the hand and wrist of Nentjes. And that is going to make men of Nentjes stay very, very difficult indeed. Yeah, I just thought like uh, I didn't want to bugger about going in the uh, strap again. You know what I mean? Because uh, at the end of the day, taking a lot of t lot of energy out of me, getting the right grip that I want, and when I know 
don't you know that I've got it fingered. Yeah. His hand purchase on you is great. All yeah, he's trying to it, do yeah. is cut you down all the time. All the time. You're getting missed all the time, so it's all right. Yeah. The fingers to Brook. The general. Rick Ninja's working in his brother's corner. Both you on the wrist. That wrist there for me. Peter the Henderson, there, Peter commanding lead. Ready, go! A little bit of a pistol <laughs> grip on the wrist there. Carves that wrist back and down. Assist him in opening the hand and wrist of Nenches. Ready, go! Big sweep to the side. Hand control secured again. And from there, Henderson can rest at the back of the pack. Nenches again with it all to do. And the Dutchman is tightening. But he's really going to struggle there. Look how wide open he is. Tries to tighten in, but he's right across the other side of the table. Hand nowhere near the centre. And he's not going to go through Henderson from there. Peter Henderson stamps his authority on this arm wrestling match. Mankenstein is on fire. Look at him in that resting spot at the back of the pad. So much power, shakes his head and then drives to the pad. Peter Henderson with the win. Yeah, come on. How's your arm feel? Okay. It now, that face? Put it yeah, it feels alright. Yeah. yeah, it's alright. He's going for press every time, so you yeah. know where he's going. He's not going to beat me. Yeah, oh, do you do that? Yeah. Yeah, he's... Pack my grip on him and I'm going to make you know what I'm going to make like that. Draw him the boat to not the zone in, then what you view. Yeah. So that you the longest can you keep. Hendrik then just saying, look, bone line this guy, knock him straight off his arm. You will flash pin him Ready if go. you do. But he's unable to do so. He reacts so slowly there. I think he was hesitant. And you can't hesitate up there. Peter Henderson was away incredibly early. Big, big drive to the back. His brother Hendrik had called for the side pressure. He didn't deliver there, and that will frustrate Maynard Nenges. Have some fun with you. Give him a bit of it. Yeah, but I'm, uh, I'm a little bit a little bit injured. So I'll go in the up with him. Keep it top. But yeah, top yeah. End, so it looks like up. Yeah. yeah. So it's half yeah. Half in, half in, half in. But I'll, 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 I'm not going to pull. Going to normally do it. Normally, innocent. Come on. Hendrik Nentjes again yeah. underlines. Look, get into this guy's arm. Demonstrating what he'd like his Both brother to do, wrist. jump Straight on top out, of his arm. And this you. time, a Peter much better grip from Nedges. Can he get any there. arm and purchase Ready on go. this <laughs> match? And that's what was called for! <laughs> and that's the result! Maynard Nedges, it I looked up, like missed Henderson goal. missed the goal there. He was turning to the crowd, and he said, I completely missed that. But whether he did or not, that was a shock to everyone in the building. Apart from Maynard Nenches and Hendrik, who'd been calling for it for two pins. He's too little, too late for Maynard, but that will make him feel better. The Dutchman has the ability, if he can engage it. And that has wound up Mankenstein, and he wants to prove this. He's gonna land in there, he wants to hit the hook. He's revved and ready now, and Mankenstein looking for his own drag, it's gone inside. Oh, look at the power. Peter Henderson sits there, he sits and he waits, and he lets the man from engage that tricep, and then he'll go on his own counter drag. He's got the back pressure applied, he's committed, he's focused, he's driven in there. And look at this match, calling on the thing. It's Mankenstein, Peter Henderson. Wait for his own <sighs> offensive. It is coming, and there it is. Wow. Peter.